What's up? We've made it to 10 episodes, dude. Are you serious? That's an extra, um, one of those O's taken up like I do on the thingies. Progress, dude, progress. So we're out, we're on Mike Ride, episode 10. And this episode is gonna be the I don't know episode because I haven't done it yet. You know what I mean? I think I need to start coming up with like catchy titles to like draw. We're stagnant. We need a new injection of energy. So I'm thinking giant titles with a question mark on afterwards. Might work, works for other people. You never know. This episode, we have an exciting, uh, exciting edi edition. Because as you know, we always go to chess camera. That's like one of the things we do, you know? And uh, on this episode, well, actually, maybe I should just let it happen organically and you see if you notice any difference. Ah, fuck it, let's talk about it. This episode, we've got an actual ad break. Yeah, we have like an ad break. Who's it going to be? We'll find out just after the ads. No, it needs to be better, it needs to be more like... And now, we'll be back just after the commercial break. <laughs> Oi, you, I saw you staring at me a minute ago when I was riding through there. Stop doing that. Start riding instead for yourself. Stop watching, start riding. Weird, dude. And we're off. There are so many people here. I'm so self-conscious when there's more people here. Anyway, it's a good track, so I thought I'd bring you along for it. What did you think of the uh, ad break? Pretty cool. Wow, I have to concentrate here. Yeah. Do you know what the cool thing about this pandemic period is? Squirrel. Yeah, cool thing. I've been riding way slower and like concentrating on braking. That's. Sorry about that, I don't know what happened. That's so boring, what I just talked about. Let's turn the cameras off. <laughs> and we're back with something to talk about this time. Not about breaking in a straight line. <laughs> yeah, so you may have noticed the uh, advert that slipped in there, you know. Dude, we're trying, to, we're trying to seek revenue from all different areas, you know. <clears throat> all means. I've been selling my body. No. So yeah, that was the focus beat your screen time challenge, which is like a Strava challenge. And uh, I'm not talking about a sort of Strava challenge where you challenge yourself to name all of the trails that someone else built in your local area and put them on trail forks. No, that's not the challenge. The challenge is to beat your daily screen time, which I think is pretty cool. It's actually, I think mine is probably really embarrassing at the moment. Um, I don't know what the UK average is, but I'm gonna put it here below the screen. But mine, I looked was coming up to three hours a while ago and that was before the pandemic which is when this like beat your screen time thing started so uh, yeah it seems an awful lot of time to spend on your phone every day fuck we got people coming yeah anyway we're at our next descent so now I'm gonna get another so now our, another partner of ours has a uh, an ad break. So thanks to the second, no, I'm kidding. Not really, but it could be. Who would it be? Pepsi. Tampax. Anyway. Actually, you may have noticed 
Your boy's got a new GoPro. Courtesy of new partners of the show. <laughs> Man, it's gonna be so boring. One day this will be just 10 minutes of solid ad. Hello, dog. Oh yeah. Cheers. Those people having a nice, peaceful walk with a lovely, obedient dog. And a cyclist comes up behind them, talking to himself really fast. I know whose side I'm on. I think that's a good way to think. So, the challenge is to beat your screen time, which I think is a, a rad challenge, actually. I think it's one that's going to be harder than I'm thinking, however. Like, I don't know, I guess I... So I think my, uh, before the pandemic was around the three hour mark, which I think is pretty average, to be honest. Um, oh, it's so sad, isn't it? That means I've got to do three hours a day, which I think I'll probably do do, which is good. So I'm in for a, in for a chance. So they've already got loads of people signed up. Um, I think they're aiming to get, oh man, I can't even remember. Let me get the, I'll get the, uh, facts and figures and get back to you. Fuck, I've not talked about much, have I? Okay, I'm back. And I've got my, uh, information here on my phone. It's a weird one, actually, because I'm on my phone and riding. So I'm, I think this, this time now shouldn't count because I am riding. But I am freewheeling. Okay, I won't be now. I'll start pedaling. Right, so... I didn't want to say the numbers because I thought it, they can't be that insane, but 82,000 people have already signed up for this uh, beat your screen time challenge. So 82,000 people are all trying to beat their screen time. How cool is that? I think that's really cool. Their aim is to get to 100,000. Um, yeah, I think you get like a bike and a Strava badge. I mean, that stuff I should really know but my phone isn't downloading the uh, full email because I'm in the woods with you guys. I checked out mine and mine's really embarrassing. Be high. I remember what it was before because me and some friends were comparing and it's now up to four hours, but I don't think that's just four hours on Instagram. I go on Facebook Marketplace and eBay so much and you know what I'm looking for you know what I'm looking for <coughs> so I think mine is up at the minute as well because I've been going on um, that PUBG game with my friends I am easily the worst out of all my friendship group at PUBG PUBG is a little like a mobile like army game I'm so bad at games, and I always have been. I didn't mind watching, but um, yeah, so I'm, I'm really bad at games. I mean, honestly, that, that uh, PUBG one, so you're a little character and you parachute out of a plane and land, and I nearly get shot instantly, quite often. Um, quite boring. Equally, it's quite boring talking about it for you. And we're on this ride together. Oh, hey, a minute ago, I just, I just uh, bumped into a giant group of people out riding. And I'm never gonna, never gonna judge, but it's so unfair. I wanna go on a giant group ride, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna stay strong. I'm gonna desperately try and do my bit to not go into lockdown part two. Dude, imagine lockdown part two. Oh, shocking. You might notice my new Gopi on the chest. That is uh, because GoPro now, they were sniffing around, dude. They were sliding in the DMs. They were trying to get on our mic rides. And, um, you know, I was real cool. I was like, shh, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, guys. We're on a mic ride. And then um, eventually I was like, oh, fine. Okay, then. Yes, okay, I'll run your cameras. Oh. It, it, it might have gone that way, or it might have been like, 
game show. Please, can I have a camera? Dude, I'm definitely going down a deer path right now. That's a, that's a world's first on this mic ride. Imagine we got lost on this mic ride, it's two hours long. Just me going down deer paths in circles. Where am I? Oh, I love the idea of living in the wilderness. Like the actual possibility of getting lost is not a reality where I live. I'm blessed with all this woodland, but if you travel in one direction, you're always gonna find like a road or a telegraph pole or something, you know? I love the idea of just being properly out in the middle of nowhere. I guess you get it in Scotland, maybe some of you lot get it, and you're probably sick of it, just lost all the time, carrying around a fucking compass. There's no phone signal. <laughs> what are we talking about again? Mobile phones, yeah. Because this pandemic, you can't really be, don't even feel embarrassed if you've got a high screen time because we're in that global pandemic and you've been told to stay indoors. But have a look on your phone and post. Actually, we could make it into a contest. Like a sort of contest that's a bit the opposite of what Focus are doing. Enter the Focus contest, first of all. And also, if you can post your screen time, the person with the highest screen time is, uh, I'll buy you a jet ski t-shirt. Man, I've said it now. I've actually got to go through with it. This is, <laughs> okay, but you can't make it up. Oh, this contest is flawed. Enter the focus contest instead. Gang, it's been a lovely ride. Actually, I'm feeling positive. I've really enjoyed going out riding with my friends. It's made me feel like we're coming out of this crappy thing. And uh, we made it to episode 10, dude. Who'd have thought we're on 10 episodes now? We're like a real show. 10 episodes is like a season. We could call it season one. Imagine the highlights and just be me getting feces on me. <laughs> yeah, big thanks for tuning in. Big thanks for all your comments. Peace. Hello. Racking up the sponos, dude. I wonder if anyone will notice. Oh, also, I've got some new um, stands wheels. Gonna put some Goodyear tires on them. Oh, I've got a new rear mech as well. Is this too much? Oh, yeah. Dude, dude, dude. They're still there. Unreal. What do you think are they watching? Unboxing videos. Makeup tutorials. Oh, yeah. Baby pandas. <laughs>